This is Code Combat. I'm currently working on Game Development 1, the JavaScript version of the course, and I'm on the level 12, Forest Incursion. Goals. Complete your own level. Increase the player's max... Ooh, cool. Max speed. Increase the player's max health. Change the player's attack damage. Use Goliath as the player. Oh, awesome. When you call spawn player XY, it returns a player object for you to modify. Perfect. You can then change an object to stuff that you can put a dot after and use methods and you'll see. You can then change properties of the player. Yep, and properties like max speed, max health. Oh, cool. So here's our player object. Where do we get the name player from? We made it. You see how we made this variable named player? If I had instead this variable named Bob, then I would need Bob.MaxSpeed to change my hero's max speed. Bob would then be Goliath, right? When I spawn Goliath in the code, I would always refer to that player, that Goliath, as Bob. Or flower, if I wrote that here. Or player, if I write player here, player always means this Goliath I'm spawning. So now on the line below, when I change the player's max speed to 12, that changes Goliath's max speed. So on and so forth. Let's give this a shot. Ooh, there's a lot of comments. Remember, comments in Code Combat are usually tips to help you out. In programming professionally, uh, programmers leave notes to each other or helpful advice. Increase the player's max health so that it lasts longer. So, what's our player name? Yep. So we spawned a player, variable player, was set equal to game.spawn player. Okay. So the player's been spawned, and we have this variable named player to use to reference it. So I'm going to type in the word player dot, and what do I want to do? Increase player's max health greater than 500. So player dot max health. equals 1500 and I'm just kind of looking at speed for an example okay so increase the player's attack damage greater than 7.0 oh, okay so increase player dot attack and make sure you get the caps right they capitalize the second letter of the words but not the first and the dot player dot attack damage uh, I'm going to be equal to 10. That's greater than that. Okay. Increase the player's max speed. Oh, max health. Did I miss that one? Max speed we got. Max health. Attack damage. Did I set Goliath as our player? Goliath was already set as our player. Complete. All right. Let me give it a shot. <laughs> this is going to go real quick with him having so so much health, and we increased attack damage, too. Ooh, he's fast. Rah! And has a ton of health. You can't hurt me. I'm invincible. <laughs> awesome. So that's really cool how they do that with properties. Right, so this is how we're changing up properties. Make sure you get the caps right when you're changing a property. And remember, it's only player because that's the variable we created. So now we have a player variable, we can increase the health, the speed, so on and so forth. Cool, let's keep going. 